Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Clumsy Cast. This is episode 11 getting recorded right after episode 10. It's actually getting pre-recorded because I want more content to upload. Um, for 2016, I already know it's the second month of the year, but <laughs> I'm going to try and make an effort in uploading more. And if that means stockpiling footage, especially Clumsy Cast, because those are easy to make. It's just me talking and shit. I would. I will. I will. <laughs> I will do that. I will do that if that's what it takes to upload more. Um, anyway, welcome back. I talked last time that um, about how maybe I could go over my game collection. And um, let's do that. <laughs> I have nothing else planned. So anyway, let's start with PS4. We're going to go backwards. Um, I could, like, get the camera out or something, but that would defeat the purpose of trying to stockpile footage. <laughs> so, anyway. Uh, real quick, because some of you might be thinking this. Um, in case you're wondering, I do prefer quality over quantity. But at the same time, if there is just, like, nothing getting uploaded, then, um... Maybe quantity is a, a good thing. Just because, yeah, uh, if you upload like a video a month and it's like the best video ever, that's great. But people won't be as interested because they won't know if you'll upload to your channel. So that's why I'm making more footage. We're going to go backwards. We're going to start with my PS4 games all the way down to my PS1. And uh, I'm only covering PlayStation in this episode, if it wasn't obvious. So let's get to it. PS4 collection. I'm going based off of uh, alphabetical order, so here we go. Um, and this is physical copies. I will talk about digital, too, because I do have quite a bit. First physical PS4 game I have is Brothers, A Tale of Two Sons. I know it's also for Steam, but I got Brothers for free on Amazon a while back, so that's why I have it. Second game, Diablo 3 Ultimate Evil Edition. I talked last time how I just got it, so I have it. Dying Light is um, the next one. It was made by the same people who made Dead Island, so I'm interested in checking that out eventually. <sighs> Until Dawn and The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Two critically acclaimed great g games from uh, 2015. Haven't checked them out, but I'm willing to give them a shot once I have the time and uh, do full playthroughs of them. <sighs> Digital copies, because that's all for physical. I have I have GTA 5, King's Quest, Infamous Second Son, Dragon, Dragon Age Inquisition. There was a lot, trust me guys. Um, I have PlayStation Plus, and there was a lot of good deals on PSN a while back. Um, Grim Fandango, I got for free. Let's see. Life is Strange on PS4. Fallout 4, obviously, that's a no-brainer. Um, that one, I actually wish I had the physical copy, but I'm cool with the fact that it's downloaded on my system. And I can play it any time, really. And uh, I might be missing a few others, but... Uh, oh, GTA 3. Uh, it's, it has, like, more frames, I think. And higher visuals, or higher resolution, but that's about it. And, um, yeah, maybe a few others that I haven't checked out yet. But uh, that's PS4 4, yeah. Uh, oh, I also think I have Dead or Alive 5 or something. <laughs> the, the One of the one of the ones that was... F I don't know if it was free or not. But I got a good deal on it if it wasn't free. Um, but yeah. PS3 collection. Here we go. You guys ready? Strap in. Okay. Um, and I'm going to go quick. Just because there's a lot. And uh, I'll be going super quick for PS2. PS2 
PS3, Assassin's Creed Revelations, Assassin's Creed 3. Those are the two Assassin's Creed titles I have, and I haven't even played them yet. Oh, Revelations on PS3 came with the first one. So that's cool. Now I don't need to get that. Um, Beyond Two Souls, Borderlands Game of the Year Edition, Call of Duty Modern Warfare, th not 3, 2. Haven't played it. Haven't played any Call of Duty uh, games, but that one was super cheap on eBay. Catherine, Darksiders, Deadly Premonition, the Director's Cut, Demon Souls, Dark Souls, Dark Souls 2, of course the Dark Souls games, I'm looking forward to 3, Eternal Sonata, uh, the fucking rat boss, Fallout 3, the Far Cry compilation which comes with 2, 3, and Blood Dragon, Final Fantasy 13 and 14, GTA 4, obviously. Heavy Rain, Infamous, Infamous 2, Inversion, the Jack and Daxter Collection, Kingdom Hearts 1.5 and 2.5, unfortunately 2.5 doesn't work. Max Payne 3, Mirror's Edge, NBA 2K 13 and 14, Need for Speed, Hot Pursuit, Nino Cooney, No More Heroes, Orange Box Collection, Ratchet and Clank Collection, Ico and Shadow of the Colossus, Silent Hill Collection, a lot of collections. Sleeping Dogs, Skyrim with all the DLCs, Sly Collection, Tales of Exilia, Uncharted 1, 2, and 3, and uh, a lot of digitally downloaded PlayStation 3 titles. Um, my mother got home, so if there's an interruption and I meet my mic, that's what that is. So yeah, uh, I really do enjoy my PS3. It does get a lot of use, but uh, one thing... One console that should get more use just because of how many games I have for it is my PS2. Unfortunately, I neglect that sometimes, but we're going to go into it because I have a lot. Um, and at the same time, I'm going to go over my Xbox collection because I paired those next to each other just because they're the same sized box. And um, I don't have a lot of Xbox 360 games. So, And these are just the ones I have on my shelf. I know I have more 360 games just in the basement somewhere just don't really uh, find it necessary to bring them out though PS2 collection a game called 13 in Roman numerals Xbox 360 game Anarchy Reigns Burnout Burnout 3 Takedown Cart Fury Champion Racing Chaos Wars Dark Cloud that one's good I still need to play more of it 360, Deus Ex, Human Revolution, and Dishonored. Disgaea, Hour of Darkness, that's the first one I believe. Dragon Quest Eight. that's a hard game, I'm not gonna lie. Femoral Fantasia, of course. Eternal Rain, if you look on the back of that, it says, Who said fantasies had to be final? Um, yeah, don't let that persuade you into getting it, it's not anywhere near the Final Fantasy series. It doesn't even hold a candle to it. Final Fantasy X and X-2. Great games. I don't have to say anything more. Final Fantasy XII. And I have the Collector's Edition. So I have two copies of XII. GTA 3 Vice City. Actually, I have three copies of Vice City. Uh, and San Andreas. Xbox 360 titles. 4 and 5. Yeah, I did have 4 and 5 on 360. But I don't play them. Gran Turismo 3 and 4. Guitar Hero 1 and 2, Harvest Moon, A Wonderful uh, Life Special Edition, Headhunter, Hulk, Inspector Gadget, Mad Robots, Invasion. I'm not even joking with you, that's a game. Xbox original title, Jade Empire, I only got it. I don't have an original Xbox, but when I do, I will play that because I heard it's one of the best games for the console. I have a couple Jam Pack games. Uh, which are just a bunch of demos, but it's really cool. Um, and I wish they did that more uh, with this generation, but, and, well, I just wish they would just make more demos in general. But they don't, unfortunately. Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2, Madden 2003, that one's random as shit. Oh, and uh, also, these are just the ones with the cases. I have a ton of PS3 and PS2 titles that uh, are just disc only because that's how I bought them. So I can go into those as well. Uh, maybe a different time though, because this is just 
solely based on physical collection. I did mention digitally downloaded games. That's a different story. It's mostly for PS4. Um, because that's, the, I guess, the direction that we might be going in, in the digital age. Uh, so yeah, physical collections. Um, Manhunt 2 Mega Man Anniversary Collection, still in its packaging. I can't wait. There's like 10 games. And the, so when I do my Mega Man marathon, because I will be doing a marathon of the Mega Man games, blind, eventually. That's the, uh, that's the one I will be playing the PS2 edition with the 10 Mega Man games. I don't know if it's just Mega Man 1 through 10 or what. Um, actually, I could just read it off. For the first time ever, play the original Mega Man 1 through 8 series and two never-before-released arcade games. So, it's 1 through 8, and then two, I guess, uh, like, one-off titles. Metropolis Mania, Mojo, Oni, Persona 3 and 4, amazing titles, just don't have to say anything else. What's this one? I think it's Poker. Uh, it's like TH3 plan. Xbox title, Project Gotham Racing. It has nothing to do with Batman, trust me. All the Ratchet and Clank games for the PS2, so the original, Going Commando, Up Your Arsenal, and Deadlocked. RTX Red Rock, Ugh, that one's a bad game even though it's made by LucasArts. Don't be fooled. Herb Sims in the City. Sims Bustin' Out and Sims 2 Castaway. Shadow Hearts. Sly, Sly 2 and Sly 3. Spider-Man 2. That's the one with the pizza delivery. SpongeBob the Movie. Spyro, Enter the Dragonfly. Eternal Night and Dawn of the Dragon. Oh, and Hero's Tale. But that one, that's the disc. I don't know where the actual box is. Huh. Super Monkey Ball Adventures. Or just Adventure. Tales of... The Abyss, Test Drive, Thrillville, Ugh, it's just roller coaster tycoon, but worse, a lot worse. It's such a ripoff, but I used to think it was good. Tomb Raider Legends, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. Tony, I have a, like four discs of Tony Hawk's Underground, but I don't think any of them work, unfortunately. Uh, and Underground 2, American Wasteland, and two more Trigger Man. And Twisted Metal Black. And those are just the ones I have cases for. That are in my room. Uh, there's a few in the basement I could go get. Finally, PS1 collection. There's not a lot, so this one's easy. Chrono Cross. <laughs> Cyber Tiger. I got it solely based on the cover because it's so silly. Final Fantasy VIII. Something road trip. I don't want to say the something because that's gonna give it away, but I'll be doing that on stream one day <sighs> Just know it might start with an H <laughs> Gran Turismo the original and Spyro year of the dragon That's my ps1 collection. That's it. It's very short. I'll be getting more eventually because I Did order some and ps1 titles. I want to try more of them out I missed out on a lot of them as a kid because I basically jumped straight into the ps2 for the most part, so that's my collection. Took me a little longer than I thought to uh, to discuss it and tell you which games I have. It might have been boring for you, but I mean, hey, I got it done, and uh, it's a video, video in the bag for Clumsy Cast number eleven. We're done. I could talk about more, but. I mean, I just want to keep it just the collection uh, topic. So talk about your collections and the reason why I'm doing just keeping it uh, the topics down to uh, just the games I have solely based on time lengths. I don't want people to be clicking on this and dreading the fact that it's like a 30 minute video. So there you go. Uh, next time we'll talk about probably something else that I came up with off the top of my head or it might be with friends you never know with me but more content to come regardless and I'm gonna I don't want to promise you but I'm gonna try my best we'll see what happens stick along it's gonna be fun see you in clumsy cast 12 or whatever else I make